Welcome back to another episode of the Hermit Poetry Series. I'm Neil Aiken, and on this channel, I read poetry, mostly work by contemporary poets, occasionally poems of my own, and once in a while, poems from the past. Today's poem comes to us from Mark Strand from Dark Harbor, which is a long uh, book-length poem broken up in different sections or parts. Uh, this was published by Alfred A. Knopf in 1993. Uh, this is section 16, or XVI. It is true, as someone has said, that in a world without heaven all is farewell. Whether you wave your hand or not, it is farewell, and if no tears come to your eyes, it is still farewell. And if you pretend not to notice, hating what passes, it is still farewell. Farewell no matter what, and the palms as they lean over the green bright lagoon, and the pelicans diving, and the glistening bodies of bathers resting, are stages in an ultimate stillness, and the movement of sand and of wind, and the secret moves of the body are part of the same, a simplicity that turns being into an occasion for mourning, or into an occasion we're celebrating, for what else does one do? feeling the weight of the pelican's wings, the density of the palm shadows, the cells that darken the backs of bathers, these are beyond the distortions of chance, beyond the evasions of music. The end is enacted again and again, and we feel it in the temptations of sleep, in the moon's ripening, in the wine as it waits in the glass. Uh, that was Mark Strand from Dark Harbor, uh, section 16. Um, this is a fantastic book. Uh, it won the Bollingen Prize uh, in Poetry for 1993. And uh, I remember being struck by it the first time I read it. And uh, it it's on my list of, of like, well, near perfect books that you encounter and you just go back to again and again. Um, so I encourage you, if you if you aren't familiar with Mark Strand's work, and for, specifically with uh, Dark Harbor, do check it out. Uh, the description of this video has information about Mark Strand, also about the book, where to purchase it, and more information about the series. Um, the series, uh, as noted in the description, runs, we have new content every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday. Um, and focuses primarily on contemporary poetry. I do read occasionally some of my own work and once in a while uh, work from world literature or classic poems. Um, I'm always open to suggestions. If you have uh, poems or poets you'd like to recommend, please do let me know. Comment below, send me a message, um, let, me, let me know some other way. I'm also open to, to finding ways to showcase the work uh, of poets right now with uh, books out. Um, and if that's you and you have a book that you'd like to uh, recommend of your own, um, please feel free to contact me and we can work out something. Um, I do have mailing addresses both in the U.S. and Canada, and so we can figure out a way to, to get the book to me. Um, and uh, other than that, I hope you're staying safe and well and active in whatever you're working on. Um, I'm grateful for these opportunities to share poetry with you. I hope that you're enjoying this. I hope that you find outlets of your own, uh, whether it is to write, create, uh, or share poetry and art, those around you, find some way to, to reach out beyond sort of the small space of your room um, and connect with the larger world. Uh, and I think uh, we live in a, in a strange but wonderful time in which technology enables us to do that. So, um, until next time, I'm Neil Aiken. This is the Hermit Poetry Series. And uh, I wish you all the very best with your writing and your creative endeavors. Um, be safe, be well, and be active in whatever you're doing. And find joy in it. And until next time, um, take care, and I'll be back again soon.